It's Bonnie. Happy Friday. I am back. We're going to talk about Victoria's Secret. I've not talked about Victoria's Secret in a long time, and I'm seeing a lot of new stuff on their website. I've kind of stopped going into my store. For some reason, our store is not very stocked. The new stuff doesn't come out, and um, it's not even worth it. So I always shop online. Currently, they do have any five for $8 each. So if you buy five lotions or mists, you're going to pay $8 each, which is like 40 bucks for five. I have not ordered anything as of yet. I haven't decided yet if I want to order anything. I do have a lot of Victoria's Secret in my stash. I should do a use it up video. One of the ones that I pulled just now, um, I had a couple of these. This is the Frost Melt Fresh Mint and Chocolate. It is hot chocolate, ignites mint and tonka. But you know what? This is not necessarily a winter sun. It's funny because um, that smells so good. Uh, Tess had just announced that uh, Bath and Body Works might be doing like a mint chocolate ice cream hand soap. I feel like this falls, yeah, this falls into that category of like a mint chocolate ice cream. I know it's kind of winter branded, but um, this is, this could be mint chocolate for summer. So pull this out if you got it. Uh, new stuff. Um, it looks like there's a new, um, line in the, you know, the core stuff. Pure Seduction. We have a Fruity Plum and Freesia. We have the Bare Vanilla, which is Vanilla and Soft Cashmere. It's saying they're new, because I sort of knew. Um, the Love Spell, which is floral with cherry blossom and peach. And then the fourth one is the Velvet Petals, which is a fruity gourmand with blooms and almond glaze. So I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Then we have the new Seaside Surf collection. So there's Seaside Surf, which is citrus, yuzu, sea salt, um, and hibiscus. We have Coastal Bliss, which is vanilla, milk, and frangipani, another floral. We have Island Rush, which is coconut cream, Tahitian honeysuckle, and woods. I'm like, I don't know if this collection's for me. And then we have Vibrant Breeze, which is um, a salty sand, coconut shell, and sandalwood. So that's not exciting me. I gotta say, not exciting. Then we have this other like electric collection, which is Electric Mango, which is mango, guava, and passion fruit. That doesn't sound bad, although it sounds a little bit along the tropical line. Um, I did see the Sizzling Vanilla online. Uh, it's red, white, and blue. It kind of looks like a 4th of July pattern. It's vanilla, coconut milk, and sugar cane. That's the one like I'm most interested in if I get any of these. And then in that collection, we also have wild neroli, which is neroli, amber, and salty air. That does not look good for me. And then neon tropic, which is bergamot, sandalwood, watermelon, and tiara. I don't know. These are not doing anything. Like I said, sizzling vanilla looks the best. Okay, so then we have another collection um, of, you know, the core scents, the love spell. This time it is um, lemon blossom and neroli. It's love spell soul. It's called the soul collection, which is sun. Um, we have the pure seduction, which is orange mimosa and pineapple. We have Velvet Petals Soul, which is bergamot and white peony. And then we have Bear, Bear Vanilla Soul. This is the only one that looks interesting to me. It is pomelo and vanilla zest. So again, not sure. Um, I'd like to actually try these before I buy. They also have a pineapple and shea body hydrating collection. It's like, uh, actually it just says hydrating body lotion. I, it's not a hydrating collection. I got too ahead of myself. Uh, it's just pineapple and shea. That's kind of interesting though. Cause they usually don't put that in there. Um, they've got the coconut milk and rose. 
Oh, but oh, oh, I was going to say Bath and Body Works. I got Bath and Body Works on the mind. Oh, Victoria's Secret, you have so much stuff. Then they have another collection. I don't know how new this one is, you guys. Bright Mimosa, how's that? No, Bright Mariposa Apricot, Apricot, Violet. Oh my gosh, this collection's so big. Then we have the Lush Orchid Amber, which is Orchid Amber and Pear. Um, oh, this one doesn't sound too bad. Okay, Brilliant Cherry Blossom, which is Cherry Raspberry and Mandarin. That doesn't sound too bad. And then we have Vibrant Blooming, which is Passion Fruit, Peach, and Florals. Oh my gosh, you guys. So much stuff. And then we have, oh my gosh, Coconut Passion, Midnight Bloom, Aqua Kiss, Bare Vanilla Shimmer. We have the whole Shimmer collection. I'm just going down the list here. Okay, I got to the end of the list. Um, there's a lot of stuff rolling around. And then we have that, I actually bought that, the Sunset Gelato. I have that. That wasn't bad, actually. Coconut Coast and um, what was the other one? Tropical Nectar. So those don't look bad. Oh, um, like I said, nothing too exciting along the lines of Victoria's Secret. Uh, Pink hasn't had anything that has thrilled me lately. I'm actually going to shop my stash. I might do a video on all of my Victoria's Secret that I have. But definitely check out uh, Fresh Mint and Chocolate as maybe like um, a mint chocolate ice cream selection for summer because it does kind of smell like mint chocolate ice cream. So anyway, uh, let me know if you guys are shopping Victoria's Secret now. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.